You make me glad by your deeds, O Lord. I sing for joy at the work of your hands. How great are your works, O Lord! How profound your thoughts! The senseless man does not know, fools do not understand, that though the wicked spring up like grass and all evildoers flourish, they will be forever destroyed. But you, O Lord, are exalted forever. The righteous will flourish like a palm tree. They will grow like a cedar of Lebanon. Planted in the house of the Lord, they will flourish in the courts of our God. They will still bear fruit in old age. They will stay fresh and green, proclaiming, The Lord is upright. He is my rock and there is no wickedness in him. Help us, Heavenly Father, not to fret because of evil men, or be envious of those who do wrong. For like the grass they will soon wither, like green plants they will soon die away. May we always trust in the Lord and do good, and dwell in the land and enjoy safe pasture. If we delight ourselves in the Lord, you will give us the desires of our heart. May we commit our way to the Lord and trust in him, and he will do this. You will make our righteousness shine like the dawn, the justice of our cause like the noonday sun. Help us to be still before the Lord and wait patiently for him. May we not fret when men succeed in their ways, when they carry out their wicked schemes. Help us to refrain from anger and to turn from wrath, to not fret for it leads only to evil. For evil men will be cut off, but those who hope in the Lord will inherit the land. The meek will inherit the land and enjoy great peace. For the Lord loves the just and will not forsake his faithful ones. Lord, you are the vine and we are the branches. If anyone does not remain in you, he is like a branch that is thrown away and withers. Such branches are picked up, thrown into the fire and burned. Lord, may our lives always bear the evidences that we are truly yours by producing spiritual fruit and works of love, but we don't want to be cut off from you. In your presence is where we safely dwell. Blessed is the man who trusts in the Lord, whose confidence is in him. He will be like a tree planted by the water that sends out its roots by the stream. It does not fear when heat comes. Its leaves are always green. It has no worries in a year of drought and never fails to bear fruit. To be an unfruitful branch is to be useless to you. Lord, help us to be ever watchful that we are not found withering away and hindering the work of your kingdom building plan. Teach us to watch and pray so we will not fall in temptation. Help us to see that when we keep watch and prayer, that we are joining you in your holy intercession. Holy Spirit, help us to set an example for believers in speech, in life, in love, in faith and purity, to be diligent in these matters, giving ourselves wholly to them so that everyone may see our progress. Help us to watch our life and doctrine closely, to persevere in them, because if we do, we will save both ourselves and our hearers. Our heart's desire is to abide in you, Lord Jesus, and to become the useful vessel you created us for. Teach us to daily look within and see your life dwelling fully there. Fill us with more of your abundant life so that we will be fresh, fruitful, and green and be a source of refreshment to those you want to strengthen and heal. Lead us daily to that quiet place where we can get alone in the light of your presence and draw life from you as we meditate on your word, so that we will be like a tree planted by streams of water, which yields its fruit in season and whose leaves does not wither. But whatever we do will prosper and bring glory to your holy name. The Lord's portion is his people. May our lives fill your heart with great delight because we have filled your banqueting table with an abundance of fruit, which is solely the result of our abiding in you. Thank you for keeping us close to you, Lord Jesus. We love you.